Innovation Oven and a regular electric oven. Hi. Hi everyone, my name is Lupita and welcome to the Cookie Couture where flavor and design collide. Today I'm going to share with you how the cookies come out when you use a convention oven and when they come out using a regular electric oven. My oven has these two options so I can use the convention and also the regular electric oven open okay i'm going to share with you how the cookies are going to come out but first if you're new here in my channel please 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 don't forget to subscribe and also if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and at the end share it with your friends okay first let me tell you what is the difference between a convention oven and a regular electric oven okay a regular oven and a convection oven they both can be gas or electric and the difference is that in a regular oven, the heat rises up from the bottom. The heat in a convection oven is blown by fans that are in the back of your oven, so the air circulates all over inside the oven. And because of this, the heat in the convection oven, it is consistent. So after this introduction, I am ready to share this video with you. So let's get started. Very good. One thing that is super important when you're going to bake cookies is how you place your cookies in your baking sheet, okay? You need to leave a space in between your cookies because you never know how big they're going to grow when you bake them, okay? So always try to leave a space in between the edges of your baking sheet and also in between each cookie. So these cookies are ready to be baked and I'm gonna bake them in a convention oven so you can see the And I'm going to put a timer at 8 minutes to check the cookies. Ooh, as you can see, the cookies are very big. Nice. But well, they're still very soft, so I'm going to leave them like 4 more minutes. Okay, let's check our cookies. Uh, the cookies still don't look very golden. And they can move now from the tray, but I think so that I'm going to leave them like two more minutes. Okay, now let's check our cookies again. I think they should be ready. Okay. They look very nice, so I'm going to take them out of the oven and transfer them to a cooling rack. And I'm going to put a timer at 8 minutes to check the cookie. I think our cookies should be done by now. Okay, I think so. My cookies are going to be open. And I'm gonna put them in a cooling rack. The cookies also look very nice. They're very, very nice on the top. And in the back, as you can see, there are more golden than the ones that we did in the convention oven. But still, they're good and they didn't grow that much. The ones that I put in the convention oven, they grew a little bit. I'm gonna compare side by side one of the cookies of each method. And so here they are side by side. Your right side are the cookies that are baked in the convention oven. So all of these ones. And these on the left are the ones that are baked on the regular oven as you can see the ones that i bake in the convention oven they look more evenly and they grew a little bit more than the other ones and they are very flat on the top and also the back of the cookie looks very nice and even in all of them And these are the ones that I bake in the regular oven. They are golden in the back. 
so for my like they're going to be drier than these ones so we will see after we make some testing okay. and here you can see they grow just a little bit more this is the regular oven cookie and the bottom one is the one that I bake in the convention oven so they grow a little bit more than the other ones and also the cookies that I bake in the convention oven they are flatter on the top they don't have any little bump as the ones that I bake in the regular oven they are like have like a little corp on the top so these are very good when you're going to put icing on them because they're gonna be flat and your icing is not gonna be very wobbly all over the place okay as you can see these ones have little curves on the top they're still very nice and flat but um, if you are perfectionist you will like a cookie that is flatter and that doesn't have any curve these are the two methods that I have on my kitchen and you can decide what will be the best method of baking the cookies for yourself. As you saw in this video, when you use the convention oven, it takes you more time to bake your cookies. So that is going to increase also the price of your cookies because your electricity is going to be higher. Okay, so it's up to you. The cookies come out very, very nice and they come out very even and you can use the three tiers in your oven and you don't have to switch them out and the cookies are going to come out always very, very nice. So if you bake a lot of cookies, I think so that is a good investment okay so i hope that you learned something in this video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please 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 subscribe share it with your friends and don't forget to be super creative in all your baking and particularly in your cookie decorating and don't miss next video because it's gonna be a cute cookie okay so see you until next time bye bye